from the Exports Network. This is the final score. Welcome to the final score. I'm AJ Good. Starting things off with high school baseball where Loretta was looking for some history on Friday afternoon. They were taking on Huntington in the Class 2A state championship game, trying to bring home a state title for the second time in school history. Mustangs of Loretta looking for their second state championship in school history. Here in the bottom of the first, Mason Tidwell going to send a solo shot off of the wall of champions in left. That's his fourth of the year, all coming in the postseason. Loretta leads this one one to nothing. In the top of the third, Huntington would respond. Braylon Rich sends a sacrifice fly here into right center. That's going to bring home Brady Warbritton. Time the game up at one apiece. Back comes Loretto in the bottom of the fourth. Lucas Laxon. He's going to send a sacrifice fly here into right. That is deep enough to bring home Jackson Tragula as Loretto now has a two to one lead. We move to the bottom of the fifth. Two on, two out for the senior in Carter Daniel. And he's going to line this ball down the right field line. That's going to be a double. Two runs come on down the score as the Mustangs extend their lead to 4-2-1, but back comes Huntington, top of the six, 2-1 for Silas Sharp with two outs. He lines a single here in the left center. Both runners come on down the score as they cut the Loretta lead to 4-3. To now in the top of the seventh, one on, two gone, but Clint Seymour is going to get Rich here to ground out to end the game as Loretta will bring home its second state championship in school history with a 4-3 win over Huntington. This means everything, you know, we felt like we've been so close every year and this year we finally all came together and we got, we knew if we got here we had a good chance and we got back up here and we had one goal. Our shirts in the tournament were 18 guys, one, uh, one goal, so we had one goal in mind and we just got it. Oh, that's exactly what it is and I think that's been the, the motto the entire year. You know, it doesn't matter if it's just one guy or it's all of them. It's, it takes all 18 dudes on this team to get this thing done. And I mean, you could see from a sophomore to a senior to a sophomore finishing that last play right there to a senior. It takes every group of guys, every guy we have out here to finish this thing. Speaking of school history, the Summertown girls tennis team was in action on Friday afternoon as well as they were in the singles and doubles finals. In singles, Libby Kinning was defeated by Ananya Paniker from Signal Mountain in the title match, two sets to none. In doubles, Emma Perry and Annalie Kelly defeated the pair from Union City in the title match, two sets to none. It's the fourth straight year the Lady Eagles have brought home a double or a singles individual title. That does it for the final score. Have a great evening, a great weekend, and we'll see you guys next week. From the Exports Network, this is the final score.